behind his net. Carries it out far side. Little flip ahead to Terpstra. Trying to Bostine alone. Converged on by two kings. Wismer joins it. Walks out goal line. Sitters scores. Grayson Padger. One times it home. Five hole. Well, after all those chances that Pound River had on the man advantage. It's a, a guy like Jack Swisber who's just so dynamic. Joins the rush as a defender behind the net. Badger's moving in from where Wismer should be. So credit to him for covering that position, perhaps. It's nice to see him continue to score. With Wismer and his Benetzel works it free. Milikoski snaps it far side to center. Stavrov through between two defenders. Benetzel in pursuit of it. Pulled out of the near corner. Oh, what a hit! Leonard in Deeks, tucks in, scores! What a beautiful goal! What a thunderous hit! That's highlight real stuff! And it's 2 nothing Bulldogs! And I've got Glenn Henderson standing next to me who I wish had a headset on to know what he thought about that. Hayden Stavroff absolutely buried a King defender. And then Samuel Leonard, his first career goal, walks in, tucks a backhand low through Watton. Oh my goodness. Little head fake to the middle, back towards the goal line and then five hole. That is uh, several highlights into one and it's two nothing Bulldogs. Whites, left side, offside. Again, a hard cross ice. Leonard finds a goal line near side. Up the half wall, gonna walk to the middle. Lasky tripped him up. Leonard kept it in with his body, trying to find it again near side, he will. Leonard. Back door walking in, Mulekoski scores! There's just way too much room given up by the Kings. Fantastic vision to find him by Leonard. I didn't think that was the most dangerous player on the ice. I couldn't even see his vision really good to find him. And he walked in and had some patience and then zipped that one, I think, five hole. Yep, just got it right through the legs. And the Bulldogs have built a 3-0 lead. Samuel Leonard playing in just his second game in the league today. Has sure looked good. It's East three Kings, no score. Ip, Nicholson, Buzio, Greenberg, Milikoski, Vanut, Kachero, Mendelssohn. Air who wins it. To the right point, wrist shot, into the body, loose on the goal line. Oh, what a save. No, the referee saying that went in. Artsit Benoff kicked it out, but the referee is saying it went across the plane of the goal line. And the Kings have made it 3-1. Oh boy, I can't wait to see the overhead that I know Oliver is going to show us now. I'm an old goalie, you know. That was a fantastic save. Here, over to the right side. That did not go in. Now it's on net, hit Bonnie's never got there. And now it's a possible two on one shorthanded led by Croucher. Left wing with Buzio to the net, Croucher walks in, he scores! That's his second shorthanded goal, and he buries it short side on one. He now leads the league in defenseman scoring shorties. Nicholas Benito set him up beautifully at the showcase. That one he showed some confidence to walk in to bury it. And instead of it being suddenly a one goal game, the Bulldogs have struck well shorthanded. Work, by the way. So Brian for slashing. Croucher left wing on a nice little flip by Whisper gains center. Buziel's busting to the net. Croucher just gains the zone. Everyone backs off. Now he'll beat him in and walk into the slot and fire and score. A gorgeous goal by Mason Croucher and it's 5-1. Holy cow. I've seen guys walk in the zone and everyone backs off, but to back off to that level to then beat a guy 
That will do it for the afternoon for Trezor Watton. And, uh, well, I've already talked about being a defender of the goalies, and maybe you need that save made, but this is from the hash marks that he's allowed to walk in. I don't hang that on the goalie. It's a second consecutive goal for Croucher. Walks across and drops for air. He'll creep in and go goal line near side. Lucarelli scores as he found Belzeal who put a wrist shot under the glove of Artsit Benoff inside the far post. 3.50. Playing the Power River zone to my left. Now out to center is Thomas near side. Dumping off the end wall. Right out front. Artsit Benoff a save and rebound. They score. As Morrow followed it up. Off the kick plate, right back up the middle. Had to be by design or a happy accident. And Arnstead Benoff makes the first save. And all of a sudden, it's a 5-3 game. At 4-18. Goals in 28 seconds for the Kings. Sandu was given the only assist on that. Hands up front again and a great save off Adam Mendelssohn as the Kings are cooking. And Art said Benoff, fantastic save. Would have been a one goal game if that one goes in. And Badger, double team, puck flat against the blade on the far sideboards in the King zone. Samuel Leonard supports the battle. Now it's a little one on one. Who's he'll try to get by defender? He scores! Five hole jams it in on a quick release. Great board battle by Grayson Badger and Samuel Leonar. And then a little bit of a power move, but I think the one biggest key for that finding the back of the net was just how quickly he put it on net. Didn't give Baker a chance to get set. Zipped it through five hole. Really like. What I've seen throughout the earlier parts of this game from Lucas Buziol. He has his third. At the net. That one blocked by Lasky. It holds it in. Couldn't get it through the body of Lunovari. And oh my goodness. That's twice. And Mason Croucher absolutely flattened him. He was the victim of the Stavroff hit earlier. Officials and the Kings credit that didn't happen. Maybe the Kings on their side would say, you want someone to jump a guy and stand up for a teammate, but you got to consider that this game is still in the balance here. There's a big battle off the puck of the far half wall. It's a wrist shot and they score. It's Stewart up front. And speaking of being in the balance, it's 6-4. I was watching Wismer 100 feet from the puck being tied up on the far side. And it continued on, and the puck came out front. And Xander Stewart throws a hit. Lucarelli into the zone, far side, and wide was Manu Cachero at the buzzer. The Bulldogs in a high scoring affair pull off the Kings. The Bulldogs win a sixth straight game. What a entertaining contest! And a lot of credit to Powell River who fought right to the end in this rink after 40 down four. Seems like a couple times the Bulldogs are gonna run away with this one, but perhaps a lesson learned when you're doing that good. Boy, you take a shift or two or a moment or two where the opposition really answers. Got a little tight around the collar, didn't it? Bulldogs are trying to decide, I think, who leads the celebratory lap here? It will be Samuel Leonar. And the guys didn't go join him. <laughs> A little extra rookie lap, perhaps, happening there. But what a performance out of him, his first career goal. Multi point afternoon. Battled a lot of adversity and super happy for him to 
have the performance he did today.